Hello, this is Reverend Don Lewis coming to you from beautiful Florida. And today our question comes to us from Kelly Ohl. And Kelly reports having difficulty with meditation, and in particular she says that she has difficulty in shutting her mind off in order to meditate. And she would like to know if I have any tips that would be helpful with this. And my first and most important tip on this subject is to take that phrase, shutting the mind off, and throw it out of your spiritual vocabulary today. If a thousand different people have explained meditation to you in terms of shutting your mind off, then a thousand different people have explained it badly. Not uncommonly, but badly. A lot of people think that meditation is about shutting the mind off, and there was a time when even I thought that before I learned how to meditate, but that's not what it's about. And this is like that term visualize that we discussed in another vlog. It's something that often becomes a blockage for people that prevents them from doing something very simple by making them think it's very complicated. Meditation is not about shutting your mind off. Rather, it's about not reacting to your mind, which is a very different thing and much easier. What you want to do when you meditate is not try to have nothing come into your mind, but rather not attach to it. It should go across your mind like a cloud across the sky. Just let it come in, let it go out, don't worry about it. Now, that's not to say you should not take note of those things that go through, but do not react to them. Do not let it start you to think, but rather receive. And you'll find that those things that come into your mind during meditation are not being generated by your mind, but are being given to you by spirit. And that is the way you really need to approach it. If you do that, I think you'll find it much easier and much more satisfying. And again, don't think of it as turning off your mind. Minds by their nature do not turn off, but rather you're not going to react to your mind. You're going to kind of step aside from it. So those would be my thoughts on the matter. I hope you find them helpful. And until next time, may you blessed be. Hello, this is Reverend Don Lewis. And did you know that I'm also a psychic reader? For over 30 years, I have been a psychic reader specializing in tarot and clairvoyance. And if you would like a reading with me, you can set one up, either by phone or by email, by contacting me at donlewishp at aol.com. And until next time, may you blessed be.